Rich Side K9 guys, just a fun, something silly, something fun to do at your house. Is it going to heat your house like you'll see on YouTube? Absolutely not. That's dumb. But will it push a lot of candle odor through the house? 100%. Is it pushing off heat right here? Surprisingly, yes, which is kind of cool. But it doesn't necessarily mean it's going to actually heat anything. It, uh, a candle with a fan on it and a candle without a fan on it is producing the exact same amount of heat. The fan is just helping to push it a little bit. But let me show you why it's cool. It is October. I don't need my wood stove on, but right on top of the wood stove, this is just a cool little project, man. I wanted to see if it would work. I took a couple wood stove fans. I got a whole bunch of them, put them on some average candle containers, and goddamn, it turned on pretty quick, uh, which is pretty cool. Right here, you can feel the breeze. Oftentimes, you can't really feel the breeze of a wood stove fan because the wood stove itself is putting up so much heat in the air that it's kind of offsetting the fan. That's why the fan helps to push it, but you don't really feel it. You just feel the heat. Right now, when I walk in front of this versus off to the side, I can feel the fans 100% blowing, which is kind of neat. It definitely helps to push the odor of the candles. Uh, no question about that. The odor of the candles is 10 times more prevalent, which is cool. And in front is a little bit of heat, so that's cool too. Really, it's just a party trick. It's something neat you can do. But if you want to push the odor of the candles and you want to produce a tiny bit of heat, it's a neat, fun way to do it. This is two different kind of fans. Uh, we normally only buy the eco fans. We have an eco fan there. We have an eco fan there. And we have like three other eco fans, but they're different colors, but they're the exact same fan. This little fan, I have no idea where it's from. Somebody sent it to me in the mail to test out, actually. Um, but there is no damn brand on it, which is kind of weird, right? It's got a temperature gauge. It's never worked. Um, but it comes on very quick and spins super damn fast. Let me show you the blade. That's the blade on it. Um, it works great. It definitely spins, no question, at a higher RPM. Oh, I'm going to put out the flying. So one of the tricks here. Ah, stand by, stand by, stand by. Stay lit. Okay. One of the tricks to running this thing on a candle on these glass containers is that you've got to get the uh, mix of air just right. So if you put the the fan too much over the opening, it'll kill the candles, obviously, because it's killing the air. So get it just right. But if you want a cool little trick with your kids, something fun, something cool at a party, you're having people over, you want to do something different, you want to push some good air, this is cool. As far as what candles, this is a normal one flame candle. I dropped a piece of paper in there by accident, well, on purpose, not by accident. But what that does is it gives it like a secondary wick, which really superheats it and lets that uh, wax smell a lot better. And these are just tri wick candles. So your normal three little things you can buy at Home Goods or where the hell ever they sell candles. But that's it. And uh, it's pretty neat, man. When you sit back here and you have people over, but the wood stove itself is off, and you can sit back and just chill, watch some TV, watch some news, and those little fans are going. It's pushing odor. It looks neat, kind of chill, kind of cool. Just a little idea.